Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Chika, aka Zigamara Ivan. This is Moment of Peace. In case if you're just visiting my YouTube channel for the first time, I would like you to subscribe and like the video and share with your friends. Today we shall be looking at a very interesting topic. Ways to earn respect as a woman. Someone will be like, why? We are in a society where women are not so respected and it is not good. I don't like it. It's not going on well. Let's go back to the be beginning and how women come about. When we look at the Holy Bible, the book of Genesis, God created Adam. After creating Adam, he, see, he, was, he was able to understand that it's not good for him to be alone. And he made him sleep and he created woman. When God presented woman to Adam, what did Adam say? Adam was like, wow. Adam was like, wow. This is the bone of my bone, the flesh of my flesh. Adam treasured the gift God gifted him. God gifted him a woman, a companion. Adam treasured Eve, the woman. So as a woman, you are a treasure. You are meant to be treasured. And as a treasure, you need to have a value to be treasured. When a treasure does not have a value, it will just be an empty vessel. So we are here to talk about ways to maintain and regain your respect as a woman being a treasure treasures are not easily seen they are not easily accessible they are not affordable to all do you understand you make yourself unique in your own unique way you don't commonize yourself if you commonize yourself you become so common you become a uniform item which is not meant to be. People will look down on you with respect when you commonize yourself as a treasure. You'll just be there as a figure, but the value is not there. So as a woman, be a person of value. How do you become a person of value? Add value to yourself. Because when you add value to yourself, that's when you'll be able to exhibit value. Seek for knowledge, wisdom, have good understanding. Interact with people that will add value to yourself. Learn things you don't know about. Understand things very well. Go seek for knowledge. Acquire skills. Get things that will develop you and make you to become a better you. And when you become a better you, you'll be able to what? To exhibit value to impact value in the lives of people around you. Nobody insults value. You dare not insult value. Let's take, for instance, in the issue of the gold, in the issue of the treasure. Being gold is treasured. As gold, it's not everybody that have access to gold. Yeah. If you give a madman gold, what does it do with it? It doesn't do any valuable thing with it because he doesn't, he's not saying to understand that this is gold. But if you give someone that values gold, gold, the person will treasure it. The person will appreciate it. And if possible, sell it on a very good price. Do you understand? Then as a woman, after going for value, the next thing you need to understand that is that you need to be resourceful. Do not be empty. Be helpful, be supportive, okay? Think of what can I do to impact positively. Don't just sit there, be proactive. You are not created to be nothing, so be something. The next thing is to respect yourself. Learn to respect yourself. Learn to treat yourself with respect. People will treat you the way you treat yourself. If as a woman, all you do is to go about sleeping with other people's husband, you don't expect people around you to respect you. Do you understand? 
jumping from one man to another. You don't expect people to respect you. Uphold good moral value. When you do that, you respect yourself and people around you will respect you. Treat yourself with respect. It's not about, I don't care what people talk about me. You better care about what people talk about you because it matters. Do you understand? It matters a lot. And then not just respecting yourself, respect people around you. You don't treat people like trash and you expect them to treat you like a treasure. It doesn't work that way. It's not just women that are treasure. Men too are treasure. Do you understand? Treat people around you with respect and they will respect you. It's only an insane person that will disrespect you if you treat them with respect. And that's on a rare cases. Do you understand? The next thing here is present yourself as a treasure that you are. Package yourself well. Dress modest. Dress as you wish to be addressed. Yeah. You don't dress like a prostitute and you come out and you want people to address you like uh, a woman of substance. You are not. What are you substance? You don't even have, you're not even a substance. (laughs) You don't exist. Do you understand? So package yourself well. Dress modest. Dress the way you want to be addressed. So that nobody will come out and body shame you or embarrass you or disrespect you or talk down on you. Do you understand? Sometimes we find ourselves probably in a marketplace or in the society where probably an argument is going on. Any sane man or any sane woman that is coming to put mouth into that will first of all look at your appearance. If your appearance exhibits responsibility, they will handle the situation with responsibility. But if your appearance is a bit irresponsible, irresponsible, they don't care whether you're right or wrong because they've already analyzed your appearance. The next thing we are looking at is what? Be disciplined. Be what? Discipline. Discipline yourself. Know when to say no. Know your limits. Know what you can accommodate and what you, can, you cannot accommodate. You cannot be everything. You cannot be everywhere. Be disciplined. Know what you can accept. What Amaka accepts cannot be what Tinere will accept. And what Cynthia accepts cannot be what Sandra will accept. Know yourself. Understand yourself very well. And know what works for you. Do you understand? You, you don't mimic. Be yourself. Be original you. You don't go about copying people. Then be dignified in your words. Be dignified what? In your words. Learn to think before you talk. You don't just talk after talking, then you now think. No, think through your words before you now spit it out. It will go a long way. Then the most priority. Top most priority is what? Develop a personal relationship with your God. Have a very good relationship with your maker. Because in all, you need the wisdom of God to guide you in things of life. When you have a personal relationship with God, you, you will say that some things, you will, as in, you, it will refine the way you're thinking, your activity, the way ah. Uh, is better experienced than said. Yeah. Build a very good relationship with God and never slack in it. Then above all, fill your mind with positivity. Fill your mind with positive thoughts. You don't become a beggar. When you beg, people will insult you. Be productive. Have something doing. Acquire skill. Add value. Love yourself. Respect yourself. Pamper yourself. Treat yourself the way you want others to treat you. Thank you so much for watching this video to the end. Please remember to subscribe and share the video. See you on the next video. Bye.